Hey guys, so this is going to be a collective haul from like end of April, beginning of May, and then just from like end of April to now. So this is like an April-May collective haul. Start off with things that I got from Old Navy. Um, I got three things at Old Navy because um, we still had, um, if you didn't watch my huge Old Navy haul, I'll link it over here. Basically, we had like a hundred dollars left, and um, we just went back. And because I don't know, my mom was looking for something, and I ended up getting some stuff too. And so, yeah, the first thing would be this let me move up. It's kind of this creamy, kind of creamy taupe color, I guess. Yeah, it's just a just a plain belt, and I wear this with my jeans, obviously, and pants. Um, here's how the belt looks like. It has a silver buckle. It's just very simple, very basic. It, that day it was uh, two buy one get one half off. So yeah, I also got another belt. I showed this in my favorites video, which I will link here. Yeah, um, and it is this woven, this brown woven belt with these bronze studs on them, just woven. And the buckle is just this kind of bronzy gold. And yeah very nice and I th and both of these I believe or size small small extra small I'm about a zero or a one in jeans so yeah if you are a zero or a one and you find these at Old Navy you'll probably fit a small so yeah the last thing I got at Old Navy were these flip-flops which I also included in my favorites video which was linked off with my belt um, and it is these black pretty 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 flip flops they're simple but they have a little flare there that rhinestone flower so pretty and yeah I basically explained them in my favorites video so if you want to know more just click that <laughs> I couldn't think of the word okay, so the next things I got at Walmart and it's just a bunch of makeup and stiffs. Well, this isn't makeup, but it's makeup related. I got um, makeup wedges. Um, what brand is this? They don't have a specific brand, but there's. This was like a dollar something. And they're not that big. They had two sizes these regular wedges, and then there were pro wedges. Um, regular wedges were one. One seventy, one dollar seventy something, and the pro wedges were bigger, but they had less, um, like a less amount. There's like um, fifteen or twenty instead of thirty-two, and it was also two dollars. And I decided I'd get more for less, even though they're smaller. But you know, I feel like I don't really need that much. Like, I don't need a huge wedge. I already can't use this whole thing to put on my foundation when I do wear foundation because I've been trying out how to wear Revlon Color Stay Wet with this. And so, yeah. Next, I got this foundation. It's kind of going to be my summer foundation, I guess. Well, okay, so you guys can't. Maybe you do notice. I don't know. Can you notice? I can't. But, um, I've been getting tanner because Sunday I went to Hurricane Harbor and then Monday, Memorial Day, I went to my friend's house and I went swimming at her house. I went to Jackie's house. You guys know Jackie. I keep forgetting. Um, and yeah, I'm just getting tanner. And I just got basically a darker foundation because 
sometimes I do like wearing foundation, you know? And sometimes, or even for like spe special events, I like wearing foundation. So yeah, Revlon Color Stay, and it is 240 medium beige. And as you guys know, um, my sand beige is a little light on me, so maybe this one will work better on me. Maybe, maybe, yeah. Especially since I'm getting tanner and stuff. I also got... I'm dumb. Okay, so sometimes I doubt my skin tone. Like, I think I'm lighter. I, I've said this a million times. I always think I'm lighter than I actually am. And so I'm just like, I don't want to go too dark. Especially for concealer, because, you know, concealer is supposed to be, you know, two shades lighter. But I, I just suck at picking out concealer. Okay, I know that this has so, like, this is such a good concealer. The Maybelline Mineral Power Concealer. And I got an ivory. You can see that. And I'm stupid because it's too light for me. Highlighter on me. Seriously, look at that. It's like a highlighter. Okay, it's not that white. But yeah, it's too light. It's basic. I I mean, I could use it for a highlighter, but I'm so stupid. Like, I need to learn how to like know my skin tone, especially for concealer. The next thing is this primer from Hard Candy. This it was this was also in my favorites video, and. I like it. Um, it's. I showed the texture in my favorites video, but I'll show you guys again. Like I said, it's kind of this moussey whipped consistency, and the the feeling of it is very, very smooth. Like I can't. Like you're just. It's very, very smooth. Like when you put it onto your fingers or onto your face, it's just really really smooth very very smooth like I can't even stress how smooth it feels it's really nice the next thing I got at Walmart was this a lot of these things I put in my favorites video but yeah <laughs> I'll still talk about them obviously um, but yeah the next thing is this dream matte powder from Maybelline and I love this which is why it's in my favorites video obviously and I am in sand medium or in sand, I don't know medium, sand, sand, medium, yeah um, and I love this, it really, it does a great job of taking away the shine on my face I'm very, sh I'm very shiny on my face all the time I think right now I'm just shiny because the light's shining on me but yeah, um, it comes, it kinda oh. slides open I love this. I play with this so much. Um, and then there's a little puff here. I don't understand how you're going to put this on though. Like, okay. I don't know. But it's very soft, but I don't use it though. I use a, I use my kabuki brush. A kabuki brush. And then there's a mirror. Mirror, mirror on the wall. The last thing I got at Walmart was this mascara. And again, this was in my favorites video. Um, this is Lash Blast. <laughs> I can never say this. Lash Blast Volume in Waterproof. It's very good at what it's supposed to do. Here's how the wand looks like. It's just the regular cover, the Lash Blast, Lash Blast wand. It's kind of fat and bristly, and there's no. It's not that flexible. It's nice and it's fat. It's fat. It's a fat mascara. When I, I don't wear it by itself, as you guys know from my if you watch my favorites video, because I have thin lashes, but I also have short lashes. So I not only need volume, but also need length. That's why I wear my falsies with it because my falsies gives me like more length than I usually have. And this one, this one does really great at volumizing. Both. I also bought a bunch of like nail polishes because I love nail polish and I I feel like I have a very small collection and whenever I get the chance I love looking at nail polish and I'm off with the basics that I got which is um 
this clear nail protector, which I guess you could call a base. You can't really read what it says because, you know, it's clear. And when Wilds writing on their nail polishes always goes away. I had, an, I had a bright pink nail polish from them once, and the, the writing just went away. Their Wild Shine Clear Nail Protector, and I use this as a base on my nails. And yeah, I also got a new top coat, and you guys have seen this in one of my, I forget, which one, oh, my Colorful Dots and Newspaper Nail of the Moment, which I'll link off here. Um, and is this baby Sasha Vite? It's so cute. It's like it's smaller than my thumb. It's smaller than my thumb. And it's so cute and like I really like this. I should have included this in my favorites, but I forgot to. But yeah, this is definitely a favorite right now because. Um, compared to my Essie Good To Go, this dries so much faster. Next nail polish I got is another Wet n Wild nail polish. And it's this pretty... It looks like... It reminds me of raspberries. Does it look like a raspberry to you? I think... I don't know. But it's called Frosted Fuchsia. It's really pretty. I haven't tried this out yet for um, an actual... on my nails yet. But it's really pretty. Purpley pink. I don't know if you guys can see that. No, you can't. Um, it's like this frosty purpley pink. It's really pretty. I love it. And my last nail polish would be this LA Colors Color 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 LA Colors Color Craze um, in Palm Tree. So it's this really pretty, okay, it's coming out, and I don't know why, but on camera it's coming out more like apple-y green, but it really, it kind of has, in real life it kind of has like, it looks more like a jade green, but for some reason on camera it kind of looks apple-y green, but yeah, um, it's called palm tree, and yeah, because I got this because I don't have any green nail polish, and I want to kind of do strawberry nails, so you need green nail polish for that. And I also want to do floral nails, more floral nails, and you need green for the little leaves. Leaves! Leaves. Leaves. So yeah, palm tree from LA Colors. Hey guys, so um, I got cut off um, on my last... I got cut off on my last recording because I ran out of time and I, my camera gets really weird when I go over time and like it slows things down. My last um, item in the haul, which were these shoes that I said, I was saying that I didn't really, they aren't really new, but they're new to me because these were my boyfriend's shoes and he just let me have them because he got green ones of these and I've been asking for him to give them to me. Hope you guys enjoyed and don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. I'll see you guys later.